Hi, this is Anita from Anita Louise Art, where each week we tell you some interesting stories from the art world. Today we're going to talk a little bit about, did Leonardo da Vinci believe in God? And this is kind of an interesting question because, you know, many people wonder, was Leonardo da Vinci the kind of person who believed in God or did he not believe in God? You know, we really don't know much about Leonardo da Vinci's personal life. He left us thousands of writings and notebooks, but not much about his personal life or his own personal beliefs. So anything that I say here is just really supposition. It is, you know, there's nothing that he wrote and he didn't say like, I believe in God or I know there's a God or he didn't write any type of religious beliefs. But it's just something that I believe in having studied a lot about him and his life. I believe that he believed in God because... There's so much evidence to show that he did. First of all, let's just talk about his painting of the Last Supper. The Last Supper painting is a magnificent work of art. And one of the things that make it so magnificent was his understanding about Christ and Christ's relationship with his apostles. If you look at it, he had the reaction of what each of the apostles said at the exact moment when Christ told them, one of you is going to betray me. And I really think to be able to, to paint that painting and to be able to make those reactions, he had to study about Christ. He had to understand something about Christ. He had to understand about the apostles. And that, I believe, was evidence to show that he understood the character of Christ, understood about him, and he understood about who the 12 apostles were that he was able to show the personality of each of the apostles, so much so that today this is still one of the great masterpieces of the Last Supper to ever be created. There are many who wrote things about Leonardo da Vinci and a bit about his character. One of them was the writer Giorgio Vasari. And Giorgio Vasari wrote a book about many of the Renaissance artists, but in the book he talked about Leonardo da Vinci, and this is what he said, I quote, his magnificent presence brought comfort to the most troubled soul. He was so pervasive that he could bend other people to his will. He was so generous that he fed all his friends, rich or poor. Though his birth, Venice, received a very great gift, and through his death is sustained an incalculable loss. So right there we learn some things about Leonardo da Vinci and his character. We learned that he was kind, he was generous. He went on to say that he was witty, he was giving, he was compassionate, he was full of grace. And I believe those are all words that show that this was a man who had a belief in, in God. I think one of the other reasons why he had a belief in God was because during the time when he lived, I think everyone pretty much believed in God. I mean, the Catholic Church was a very strong influence during his time. People attend a church. They had he had religious commissions from the church. There's no evidence to show that he didn't go to church or he didn't believe in God. In fact, probably quite to the contrary. Like everyone else during his time, he would have attended, probably would have weekly attended church meetings or maybe even more than once a week. You know, Leonardo da Vinci was he was well liked. He was highly respected, not as just being an artist, but his character. And because of the fact that they wrote so highly of his character, this also shows that he seemed to have been a man who had some belief in a religion or a God. He was also a very much of like a humanist, and he, he really believed in the, the human body, he believed in the human nature, he believed in man. You know, during the Renaissance, there was this very much this humanist thought where there was, you know, there where they basically believed, you know, in education that, you know, to help educate society. Uh, believed in both private and civic virtue. They you know, understood that non-religion studies were essential and they encouraged them. They had an emphasis on the importance of observation, critical analysis, and creativity. But they also believed in that with, together with the belief in God. So when I look at these points and I look at this, I could see how Leonardo da Vinci maybe you know, was kind of a bit of a humanist, but also had this belief in God. Because there's no evidence to show that he did not have a belief in God. In fact, to the contrary, it shows, a lot of evidence shows his writings in, in a way show that he was religious and that he believed in a God or a higher being. You know, almost everyone, as I mentioned during his lifetime, would be shown or would at least show or would seem to be religious, and especially to be able to receive you know, some of these religious commissions, which he did. 
So my answer to the question is, did Leonardo da Vinci believe in God? Yes, I believe he did, even though he did not write it down or there's no direct evidence to say where he directly told us that he did, but there's lots of other evidence to show us that he probably did. We hope you've enjoyed this video and we'd love to have you subscribe to our YouTube channel, become part of our community. Check out our description below. We'll have a link to our blog post that talks about if Leonardo da Vinci believed in God. And we hope that you will join our community, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and we'd love to hear from you, hear any questions or comments you may have. Thank you so much for listening. Thank you.